Sean's a tell of the boxingvoice.com with the money team zone, Andrew the Beast to Beatty, undefeated cruiserweight, a bad man. How you doing, Andrew? I'm doing good, doing good. Man, uh, it was very, it, we're, the day's almost over now, but what you guys did today was a beautiful thing for the kids here in Vegas. Could you kind of let the boxing fans at home know exactly what the money team did today? Um, today we had a back to school event and um, you know, it was, it was real cool. We was basically giving back to um, the kids that's going to school and you know, just charity work. That's, that's, that's what, basically what we did today. Now you guys were, uh, you gave around like 600 backpacks and this was what, the third year in a row? Yeah, yeah, so you know, it's, it's real cool to uh, come out here and support and support the positive things that Mayweather Promotions are doing. You know, I'm just blessed to really be, be a part of this team, so it's cool. Do you, Andrew, do you think that Floyd doesn't get the credit he deserves from the press, media, for doing things like this outside of the ring here in our community here in Vegas? Uh, you know, no, nah, you know, he doesn't get the credit, but um, Man, you know, Floyd Mayweather, he's a real good guy, man. Um, man, he blessed, he blessed so many people. He feeds a lot of families that people don't know about. Man, he's a wonderful guy. Um, true angel, man. Um, he, he blessed me. He put, put me in the right position in life, you know, for me to have goals and future goals and, and opportunities. So, you know, he's an angel. Oh. What about studying Floyd in the ring? Do you, do you try to take some of the technique that's made him such a great fighter? Because watching you ringside, it looks like you do. Oh uh, yeah, um, yeah. Everything that he do, um, basically, um, hit, don't get hit. You know, defense. You know, you know, also training with his, um, his dad. So, you know, I pick up a lot of his style. He has he, a lot of style that he does is like, you know, what, he, what his dad taught him. His dad teaches me now. So, you know, we kind of, in a way, I, we have similarities in styles. Yeah. Uh, you know, everybody's talking about you coming up at cruiserweight. You're undefeated. You just fought on PBC to open up uh, BJ Flores and Babu Shumanov's card. So you will be fighting, I believe, the week of Mayweather Berto, right? Um, no, we don't, we have something maybe October. Uh, so they, they gonna give me they gonna give me um, a break. You know, uh, I've been busy this whole year. I supposed to fight um, the Mayweather Pacquiao, but it, that didn't happen. But I've been training hard this whole year. Um, you know, so we gonna we gonna maybe look for some October. This is this is obviously looking down the line. But could Andrew Tabidi ever be make a run at the heavyweight title? Hey, yes, that's the plan. That's, that's basically my future plan, my goal, my dream to basically be heavyweight champion one day. So, you know, I hope it happens. And, um, you know, I, I have a wonderful team here with Mayweather Promotions. You know, um, Leonard Ellaby, Floyd Mayweather, um, these guys bless me. And um, I, they're going to put me in a position to, to do that. So you're trying to go the Evander Holyfield route, start at Cruiser, win the title there, then move up to heavy and... Yeah, that's, that's basically the plan. Um, you know, that's one of my idols, Levander Holyfield. He's small, small heavyweight, and I, I think I can do it. Um, you know, it's going to take a lot of work. It's going to take a lot of dedication, but I'm ready to do it.